In my previous how to fix videos, I discussed about few of the breaking changes of GPT index because now it has been renamed to LLM index. So there are many things which have uh, which has changed and like its respect to API calls or the way we are calling the functions or the parameters which are taken by the functions. Those all things are broken. So I have already created few videos but looking like there are still more issues which uh, most of you are facing so thought to come up with the entire code changes which are required for my previous code base so this is the code which you must have seen earlier and if you will run this code it is not going to work because there is nothing called gpt index now so how to get this fixed so the very first change you need to do is instead of gpt index you need to call ll emma underscore index once this is done you will see that the another error which it is throwing is about gpt simple vector index so it means now gpt simple vector index is also not available rather it is having gpt vector store index let's run it once and see okay so let me import my configuration because this is the place from where I am reading my key. Okay, so we are done with the first part. Now coming on to the second part, if you will execute this code, it is saying executed successfully, but eventually it will throw you at event as in when you will proceed. So here we need few more changes. The very first thing is these things are all good till here there is no change but if you will look at these two lines these are not going to work these are the breaking changes so the very first thing we need to do is let's go here and import service con context so i will say let me import here itself but you can do it above also not a problem from index import service context so once service context is imported we need to create its object so let's say service context equal to service context dot from defaults and inside this function you can just grab this thing i will cut it and put it inside this okay now let's fix this particular line so what we need to do here is gpt simple vector in instead of this we need to call this class so let's go ahead and use this class and say from documents okay so now it is going to take two parameters first is this one and the second one is our service context let me copy it again okay so once this is done we need to save our json files so no need to do this particular thing let's get rid of it and now we are going to use storage context so for storage context again we need to import it first so let me quickly do that this is your storage context and here what we will say is vector index dot storage context dot persist persist Okay, inside this you need to tell the directory name where you want to persist your output. So persist underscore dir equal to and here I am just saying store which is the directory name for me. And this should fix it. It's okay. We don't need to return this. We can just get rid of this return statement as well. Okay, now it is working fine. Next thing is we need to update this function as well because now we do not have load from this rather we need to load it from the storage so for that we need to go here and 
again import one more thing which is load index from storage let me execute this cell okay now this is the part where almost everything has changed so very first thing we need to is let me quickly remove this we don't need this at all so i would say storage context because now we need to read it from the storage context and here again you need to use from defaults versus directory let's copy this part because this is the directory from where we are going to read then we need to load our index so we'll say index equal to load index from storage and inside this you need to pass the storage context which we just defined here let's copy it okay next we need to construct our query engine which was not there earlier this is again the addition and would say index dot as sorry as query engine okay and the final thing which we want is uh, passing our questions so we'll say response equal to query engine dot query and inside this we can pass our question so I would suggest let's call it like that and this question we can take as it is inside this query function okay once this is done you can return the response return response Okay, so let's try this and try to fix if anything else is breaking. And before that, let me make a call to this. So we'll say read index, and my input files are placed inside uh, this input directory. So that's the reason I'm doing this. Okay, looking like it has done. So if you will go to your directory, you will see that inside stores few stations are there it means things are working perfectly all right till here let me go ahead and execute this answer me okay now i would say answer me which let me give some question which was the recent release because this data is about movies and the series so let me check which which movie was the one which released recently and i would say let's call it response run it okay so again we have something engine it should be okay run it okay so it means some is working let's go ahead and print the output so it is in response and you can see that the output is here it means these were like five to six changes are there which you need to do if you want to make this thing work so I hope this clear all your doubts and if you feel that there are more code changes which are required or anything is still breaking based on the previous APIs. Do let me know in comment section and I will try to fix them as soon as possible. Thanks for watching.